Spooky Success Stories. Thank you Spooky2 team for all your infinite effort in making this amazingly sound healing device so affordable for people. This will be a revolutionary amongst medical practices and humanity. I am amazed how you have made it so easy to use for a beginner and is so incredibly healing. I have so much more energy using the detox at night with the BW remote and quartz crystals and organite creating a grid. And what did I see? Settings for organ, zero point energy where I like to meditate with. In the daytime I heal my broken ankle using cartilage, tendon and muscle repair settings with a cold laser, then as I go hiking I run same frequencies via remote, healing while I walk. So I have many thanks for Mr. White and his amazing team, who have helped me endlessly with all the online support. Much love and light. Best regards, Catherine Lee. Dear friends this is a story of a success with a spooky too after about a year of treatment, patience and hope. It is an eye disease called keratokinus. Keratokinus is a degenerative disorder of the eye in which structural changes within the cornea cause it to thin and change to a more conical shape than the more normal gradual curve. Keratokinus can cause substantial distortion of vision, with multiple images, streaking and sensitivity to light all often reported by the person. It is typically diagnosed in the person's adolescent years. If both eyes are significantly affected, the deterioration in vision can affect the person's ability to drive a car or read normal print. Keratokinus is an incurable and irreversible disease. It can only worsen with the passing years. The only way to remedy this is to use special contact lenses or in more severe cases perform surgical operations until the transplantation of the cornea. When I discovered that M no longer saw a good right eye, the ophthalmologist diagnosed me unfortunately this disease. In addition, the cornea was opaque. The doctor explained to me what it was, and that if things would get worse, we had to think of a surgical operation, since there is no cure or medicine. M in previous years had suffered many hospital stays, as he had suffered severe neurological damage from vaccines. Then undergo a surgical operation. He did not even think. I immediately checked that the disease was present in the Spooky2 database and when I found it, I took hope alive. So I started to run the program in remote, at least once a month for 4-7 days, knowing full well that such an illness, I could not expect results in a short time. It all began in September 2015. The September 8, 2016. I returned with M in the same hospital to understand how the situation had evolved. When the doctor visited him, I knew from his face that something had happened strange but positive. To the astonishment he tells me that the cornea is completely clear and transparent previously opaque and, something never seen before, the deformation of the cornea was decreased in practice keratokinus is shrinking. To the left is the image of corneal. Topography followed in September 2015. The following is the image of corneal topography followed in September 2016. I think that even an incompetent person can see how the deformation is less, in the right image. M and I are extremely happy with this result. It's not over. We are only at the beginning. But today the hope we have is much stronger. We must continue with the therapies and continue to do so with patience and perseverance. Anything is possible. Just believe, just have one spooky too. Marcelo Allegretti. Postpartum preeclampsia. My niece developed preeclampsia during her first pregnancy, and as a result her son was delivered by C-section three weeks early. Normally this resolves the situation but with my niece it did not. One week after delivery she was readmitted to labor and delivery with the diagnosis of postpartum preeclampsia. It is a rare condition with potentially terrible complications. I visited the next day and found her high blood pressure and swelling were only slightly better, and her headache was as bad as ever. The nurses were begging her to sleep and expressed worries that she would have a seizure. I offered to treat her remotely and she agreed. I went straight home and started three generators, using the white remote and JW healing settings. Number 1 Detox 4 Toxins Throughout the Body and Detox 3 Toxins in Kidney and Liver Number 2 Eclampsia Number 3 Fluid Retention Extra, Renal Excretory Insufficiency, Detox Toxic Headache 1 and 2, Detox Toxic Proteins. 
she felt better almost immediately. The next day her headache was gone, her blood pressure was almost normal, she was getting rid of her excess fluid, and she was discharged home. I kept the generators going. On day 5 I turned off generator number 3, the next day number 2, and the next number 1. She has completely recovered. One word of caution this should not be done while a woman is still pregnant. I think it would be similar to your children getting into grandma's blood pressure medicine. Good for grandma but not for the children. Denise Snooks In June 2015, my wife detected a suspicious lump on her right arm axillary node within the outer region of her breast. Her mother was diagnosed with breast cancer more than 10 years ago and survived, albeit with lingering side effects from the toxic chemo, radiotherapy and invasive surgery. I took her to our family doctor, who seemed very concerned and fast-tracked my wife to the nearest specialist hospital breast clinic in our region, where we were seen by a breast consultant. He examined her and said he thought it might be benign and we ought to do a mammogram and biopsy, which we flatly refused. Instead, we opted for an ultrasound. My wife was taken to another room for the ultrasound whilst I was seated in the waiting room. A few minutes later my wife came out of the room in a panicked state, apparently, the nurses were about to perform my mammogram which we had refused to do earlier. I went in and gave an earful to the nurses and sitting consultant. We went ahead with the ultrasound and the consultant detected another lesion on the upper part of her right breast. The consultant in the room wanted to a biopsy and again we refused this as we were well aware of potential seeding of cancer cells to distant locations in the body. When called back to the original consultant's room, he strongly advised us to do a biopsy as he now thinks that it is malignant. I stated our reasons for refusing a biopsy and opted to address the suspicious lumps with a whole acidic approach. To his credit the oncologist did not pressure us, but advised us to think strongly about our decision to forego further diagnostic tests and subsequent treatments. I placed my wife on an alkaline diet, cutting out meats, dairy and sugars. She took beta-glucans, vitamin D3 and melatonin. Even though, we had spooky, we didn't use it as much as we should have done. In July 2015, we received a further letter from a senior oncologist at the hospital to reconsider our decision as he thought the lump detections were serious. He also stated that there was no evidence for natural cures to cancer and dangers of seeding from fine needle aspiration. Our doctor was sent a copy of the letter from the consultant and so she contacted us to try and urge my wife to go and see the consultant again. I wrote back citing several peer-reviewed studies on natural herbs being effective on several cancer cell lines. I never heard back from them regarding my letter. I performed a biofeedback scan and several breast cancer hits were returned from the reverse lookup. This did not phase us at all since we have been through two family members with cancer and treated them successfully with natural treatments. We decided to go on holiday abroad in mid-July, I came back within two weeks due to work. However, my wife and kids stayed back. She did not adhere to a strict diet and was eating unhealthily. By the end of August, my wife called me crying on the phone. Her lump on her axillary area had tripled in size and it was causing her considerable discomfort. I told her to return immediately. The lump in her breast area that was detected during her ultrasound scan was now palpable. I immediately contacted Char Bohem and she advised me three DNA frequency sets to try. One of the DNA sets was the human mouse mammary tumor virus. I used the three DNA frequency sets on my wife with remote treatment every fourth day alternated with remote treatment using results obtained by the biofeedback scans and general breast tumor, breast cancer, cancer BX and cancer BY programs in the database. I used John White's kill per sets running programs no more than four repeat sequences at a time lasting 3.5 hours to 5 hours, two to three times a day together with detox and blood cleansing heal programs on the white remotes using David Alliday's presets. Within four weeks the large lump on her axillary node had shrunk by about 50%. Within two months it had shrunk by 80%. The lump on her main breast area still remained though. My wife had a HCG Navarro test done which still confirmed the presence of cancer by the elevation of HCG markers, although, not by a significant margin. 
I purchased Spooky Central and Plasma System in January 2016. I started applying Char's DNA frequencies via Plasma method around February 2016, combined with Spooky Central contact and PEMF coil. Again, I alternated with frequencies obtained by biofeedback scans, the general breast cancer, breast tumor programs. After 30 days of using the plasma, the lump in her axillary had reduced to about 10% of its original size and could barely be felt. The lump in her main breast region was no longer palpable. I continued using the plasma method only, since it only required treatment once a day. The detox, blood cleansing and immune system rebuilding were done on the white remotes. The biofeedback scans confirmed the reduction of cancer. The very first scans returned about 16 hits, then it was down to 12, then 8, then 6 and then eventually no hits. The scans were a good indication to see if what we were doing were working for us or not. Now, my wife has a tiny speck left of the lump in her axillary, which I feel is hard scar tissue. We do maintenance sessions now. I feel with the combination of Char's DNA frequencies, biofeedback scans, breast tumor and cancer programs from Spooky's database using remote, plasma, Spooky central contact and PEMF detoxing and boosting immune system has helped her condition tremendously. One important issue which we tackled was my wife's dental problems. A few years ago her dentist stated that she might have to have root canal. I read about the link between breast cancer and root canals, so we also did the dental foci programs for about a week. I have attached medical notes and biofeedback scan reports to verify the veracity of our story to the Spooky team. Thank you to ALL the team at Spooky especially John White who works relentlessly to continuously improve the system for the betterment of human suffering. To my fellow seekers for optimal health. I happen to be one of those people who has tried everything in the world and read scores and scores of others testimonials of people who have gotten their health problems resolved by the many different things I had tried yet without success for me. I've used chiropractic, acupuncture, homeopathy, EFT, hypnosis, brain entrainment, minerals, herbs, grounding, coconut oil, diatomaceous earth and on and on. For the last 50 years I have suffered from chronic fatigue brain fog, weakness, diarrhea, constipation, muscle spasms, night sweats, daily unrelenting pain in my feet and legs and obesity. I got to the point where I said I never feel good and sometimes I feel worse. From taking over the counter pills for pain I ended up in the hospital and nearly bled to death. That was possibly the worst experience of my life but God was not ready to take me yet. There are probably few who have worked harder than I have on trying to improve my health on a daily basis year after year. It's an awful thing to lose hope and give up. I didn't give up because I knew if I didn't find the way to regain my health no one else was going to do it for me. I thought that I must be doing myself some good with all the things I was doing. As one person put it on the web I wasn't really getting deep enough and specific enough with all the other things I was doing. Still it wasn't easy. In order to get better a person has to get the things causing the problems out of their body. This is called detoxing, detoxifying or herxing. When those old viruses, bacteria, parasites, molds, spores, medications, yeast, plastics, pollution molecules, pesticides, herbicides, heavy metals and so on come out through the various rot such as the stools, urine, skin, lungs, etc. You can experience a whole host of symptoms that are actually good things because they are a part of the healing process. These could include headaches, rashes, diarrhea, constipation, foul tastes or odors, muscle spasms and twitches, blurred vision, fluid in the ears, pain, and fatigue and so on. Some people stop when they start experiencing these things but if you stop you'll never get better. Because of all the different problems that I was harboring it took me a good month of daily work spending a lot of time every day to start to see the improvements I was looking for. I could see how someone might think things weren't working if they didn't get better right away. I've used a variety of nutritional supplements while going through this. The only one I'll mention here is diatomaceous earth. It helps the most in getting toxins removed from the body that are coming out of the tissues due to using the rife frequencies. 
My blood pressure is coming down. My weight is coming down. My pain is less. I'm able to start exercising. I'm sleeping better. I'm able to walk without a cane more often. I'm continuing to improve day by day. I started with one generator and am now using three because others need help including our doggies. I am now only using remote. I love the create a program feature because I have found I need to be very specific on a number of things and I have made 680 programs of my own. Thank you, thank you, and thank you again for making this wonderful tool available. In the year that I've been using it there have been an incredible number of additions and improvements. I thank God for what you've done and for leading me to find your tool. How wonderful it would be if everyone could use this instead of being in a model that thinks people were born with too few drugs and too many organs. How many drugs does a person have to take and how many organs have to be removed before this person is totally healthy? Kind of silly isn't it? Dr. J. California our hallelujah moment. My husband was in a very horrific car accident in 2014 at the age of 40. He sustained compound fractures in his ankle and his arm. Due to his injuries, he now has chronic pain due to the server bone damage. We were on a camping trip in the winter of 2015 and met Claudia. She and her husband introduced us to Spooky too. Before we left she asked for fingernail samples from Brian and Hayden. Hayden, our daughter, was having her wisdom teeth pulled that week and she said she would run a dental procedure on her that day. Well, after the procedure Hayden only took three pain pills after having all four teeth pulled, and within 24 hours she was acting like nothing had ever happened. She said she only took the pain pills because she was nervous about them starting to hurt. She was never in any discomfort. My husband then said, how much is that spooky thing? So, I started looking into it. When I told him it was around $500 he said to order it, so I did. It took some time to figure things out but it wasn't long before we had our first hallelujah moment. We had a yard sale and he was trying to help out, even though he knew he shouldn't he overdid it with carrying a heavy item. That night he asked me to hook up the spooky because he needed some relief. I got him set up in contact mode and hit start. It ran the first frequency then the second and when it started the third he yelled, that's it. He said it was instantly gone when the third frequency of the set started. It was truly our hallelujah moment. With chronic pain from bone damage, there is no medication that has brought him any relief like the Spooky 2 has. We can never thank Claudia enough for introducing us to Spooky 2. Not only has she helped with my husband's chronic pain but we have made a lifetime friend. He is unable to work due to these injuries and on a fixed disability income. We would be so thankful to receive free spook stuff. Spooky to rocks. Brian, Heath and Hayden Bishop. To say that Spooky 2 has made a difference in my life is an understatement. Where do I begin? Should I share how my children will text or call me from school asking to run a program for them? Either for sniffles, sore throat or pain? How it has helped my older child with bed wetting. How about reducing the itching and swelling of bug bites on my four-year-old. Then there is the time it helped my sister-in-law 5,000 miles away with her hives in less than 30 minutes. Or when I took my units to my sister's who had a mysterious illness and within 36 hours we broke her fever and she was able to return to full health in less than a week. My niece went to Guatemala and gave me her nail just prior. She twisted her ankle and had been in pain for quite some time. I ran the song of the spine program for her and she said she had no pain for the entire six weeks she was there. Then there are the mental benefits. Like the one for taking tests and how my kids felt like they were able to think better for their finals. Or when I was having a hard time thinking and ran some whole brain programs and felt like I could move forward the day. Then there was the time my children were fighting with each other and I put all four of their nails in and ran peace and calming programs. The fighting ended within 20 minutes. I think however the biggest change overall is the reason I got the spooky in the first place. I have Lyme disease. I discovered I had it four years ago after having it since 1993. I take a while to think about my treatment choices. In fact, it took me nine months using Spooky for many other reasons before I felt like this was something that I needed to do. 
In October of 2015, I started the Morgellons Lyme Protocol. At the time I was pretty consistent in having more bad days than good. In fact, I celebrated a good 15 minutes. I had major brain fog and I was exhausted all the time. My husband had to come home from work early to help take care of our children. We made it through the entire protocol in three and one half months and I felt a bit better. We have since done this protocol almost four times. Each round I feel a bit better. Round three was the game changer for my body. I had more energy than I have had in a long time. Our family went on a two-week vacation in an RV. I had minimal recovery from that. It seems that each round is helping me to improve exponentially. I am able to see bigger differences and now when I have a bad day, it makes me that much more grateful for the consistent good days that I do have. Each week I also go to see someone that does a live blood test on me. She takes a sample of my blood and we look at it under a microscope. It did not take us long to learn that whatever I was running on the spooky, that is what we would see in the blood. If I was detoxing metals and chemicals, we saw a lot of those. Bacteria there was a lot in the blood. Treating parasites brought out worms and other creatures. Both of us are astounded at what we see. She has been doing testing like this for over 10 years and each week she sees something in my blood. That she has never seen before. She tells a lot of her clients about this spooky as well and how it has helped me. She has noticed a huge difference in how strong I am. I can handle these programs a lot better now. Thank you to everyone at Spooky for this amazing machine. It has changed my life for the better. Sarah Scaveland. Hi my name is Pat Audison. I acquired my Spooky 2 inches February 2016. I had a fractured pelvis and a fractured leg from a fall on January 1, 2016. So, I have lots of time to search the internet for interesting subjects. Then one day I was reading Tom T. Moore's newsletter and he had mentioned that a friend of his had a spooky too. I am a retired addictions counselor, so have had an interest in healthcare for over 20 years. I started to research this instrument that had a weird name, but it made me smile every time I heard its name. I also believe in intuition, because when I started reading about it I had a feeling that it was the right thing for me to purchase. At first I thought this would make a good hobby but then I thought oh there's lots of computer stuff I don't know if I want to wrap my head around it. But my mom has recently passed from dementia and I thought well this will be one way I can keep my brain active. So I bought the advance kit and waited patiently for it to arrive. However I did do a lot of reading about it from the guide and from the videos that are online. I bought all the necessary extras that I needed to have available when it arrived. And when it did arrive I had it set up and ready to go with a little help from a fellow named Ed. And then I was off and running with Spooky too. I had several ailments. High blood pressure, slow pulse, fibromyalgia, fractured shin and pelvis, obese, and I was on several medications. So those were my main treatments on myself. From February until May I didn't notice any difference. Then one day I was in the shower and I almost passed out, fainted. And that's when I went to the doctor to find out what was going on. And she ran me through a whole bunch of tests. I have been trying to lose weight so I had lost probably 30 pounds, but I just was not feeling very good at all. Nauseated dizzy not very energetic I was still on crutches so it was hard to get around. And I was accustomed to recording my blood pressure and my pulse so that when I go to the doctor I could take this with me. And she was very concerned about my pulse how low it was. She suggested that I discontinue one of my meds because my blood pressure was so low also. And because I haven't had any bouts with fibromyalgia pain I had also stopped taking the amitriptyline that I have been on for several years. So after about about a month my blood pressure stabilized and my heart rate was above 60 on a regular basis. The doctor was very happy about that. I still take one medication for high blood pressure and I'm still working on trying to get that back to normal or average. So I know Spooky works because it's working for me. And I have been using remote to send sessions to friends and family with great results. I purchased two more generators and they run almost non-stop on myself and others. Thanks Spooky Pat Audison. 
I have several other rife type of products and I've only had the spooky two for less than a month. I'm a sensitive person. It is clear from the start that Spooky 2 is more complete and much more powerful unit than the PC-only units. The radionic broadcasting feature of Spooking 2 is very clearly detectable and highly effective for me. I know for sure my health has improved from its use just in this very short amount of time. The feedback process was very impressive. I set it to return 10 hits. Using the reverse lookup I was able to see that all the 10 hits were targeting my prominent issues. Spooky 2 is an objective alternative an objective opinion and a major part of a health solution all wrapped in one. What's more I have nearly unlimited health support for whatever may come along. The completeness of the established frequencies far surpasses other units I've tried I feel it is very likely that Spooky 2 is the best single investment anyone can take for their health and their friends and family's health and well-being. Spooky 2 seems to address all aspects of body, mind, spirit integration. I'm very appreciative of Spooky 2. Paul Gayski Stroke testimony My mother is age 89 had two strokes last year. The first one in February from which she recovered very well and the following one in May where she was not so fortunate and was totally paralyzed and bedridden. Her only movement was to be able to feed herself with a spoon with her left hand. She was like a small child. We were devastated. I contacted a close friend who does brain gym work on a remote level. The following day I went to the hospital to find that my mother could turn her head to the left and raised her left arm and said, look. The doctors had told her she would not recover this time. When I contacted my friend that night she told me that she had already carried out the healing on my mother that morning and had worked with some emotional issues and cleared them. The change was amazing. Within a week she was transferred to a rehabilitation hospital where she spent six weeks in intensive therapy to learn to walk all over again. By the time she left the DRS told her that when she arrived they never thought that she would ever walk again. Upon discharge from rehab six weeks later she was walking again with a walking stick with some balance issues and had remained the same since then. Five weeks ago she had been worrying about a family matter for days and she had become extremely tired and all of a sudden she lost her speech, mouth dropped, could not see things in front of her and could not walk and was clearly having another stroke. She said that she would not go to hospital and my father had said that she did not have to go if she didn't want to. I sat and thought for a bit and relived the last two hospital visits with her last two strokes. I had spent the entire time with her in her recovery and knew exactly what the DRS did and did not do those two times. What did occur to me was that when we took her to hospital, she would lie there until the drive came and then he would say, We are sending you to Adelaide. They would continue to give her the normal medication she was on and prepare to send her by air to Adelaide. This would take about 50 minutes. Within an hour and a half she would be at the major hospital in Adelaide where she would lay in a holding bay for hours before being attended to. Then they would move her to outpatients and she would spend the night there and finally the next day to a ward. Exhausting stuff for even a 20-year-old even. Knowing that she wasn't going to hospital and that my father would not force her I knew we were in serious trouble this time, she was having a full-on stroke. I had had spooky too for about three weeks at this stage. Up until now I thought that my mother's recovery had been awesome and that she was amazing, but what comes next is just out of this world, and to this day I still find it a little unbelievable that it happened. I knew I had to get her BP stabilized. I checked the internet to find out that the DRS don't bring the BP down too fast, so the first step was to normally her BP slowly. I cannot remember the settings on that. In fact I read and read about what the procedures are with a person having a stroke. But the one thing that really made me think was that both previous times, in the first week of the stroke the DRS actually did nothing, they waited until a week later and just monitored her then did a scan and said, yep. You have had a stroke and we will change your medication. Once I got my head around the fact that they didn't really do anything I realized that I had spooky and what was I waiting for. My intuition kicked in and I began the marathon for the next five days. I observed every change in her and worked out what was happening to her at each stage of the way. Examples of that were her face and especially her nose quite swollen. 
I realized that she had fluid retention possibly on her brain and found the settings in Spooky for that and ran that until it all went away. I moved through each and every symptom methodically for a period of four days. She slept for hours each day and all night. Her BP would go up I would adjust that and normalize it. When she had pain in her face I would adjust that and work on balance. On the Sunday evening she took a turn for the worst and had a nasty headache again. At this point I suggested she go to the hospital. She said, no way. Checking her BP, it was down really low. I thought, no this is not a good sign, so worked on normalizing again only to find that I had not reset Spooky from bringing it down the previous night and it had gone too low. A quick move to normalize it again and work on that headache. At this point I thought I am going to be up all night checking her. Working on her headache and normalizing the BP I suddenly realized that she was probably lacking oxygen and went to Spooky to see what I could find. To my delight I found several settings for oxygen, oxygen to the brain etc, and set them running along with BP normalize, balance, several headache settings. One half hour later I took her BP again and asked her how her head was. She said, it is gone, completely gone. I feel fine. Her BP was right on the nail after all I was going to get some sleep that night. The following morning Monday my bedroom door opened and in she walked with her walking stick bright and chirpy as if the previous five days never happened, she was 100% back to normal as she was before the turn. At first she said, I just had a virus, but when I told her that she could not talk, walk and see things and how bad she was she remembered the dreadful headache she had. I showed her what I had done with Spooky and she was in disbelief. She said, you took away that dreadful headache with that thing. We all did not talk much for the next few days as we were all in disbelief that she had come out of what seemed to be a severe stroke to at least the same level as her previous one that paralyzed her. Sometimes I look at her in wonder and think did that really happen? But there you have it. Spooky is an amazing tool that you can go to. There was no hard work to do it was all in there all I had to do is recognize the problems each step of the way and adjust Spooky to each symptom. Along with Google search and Spooky we came through with flying colors. Just a few weeks ago I spoke to my friend who is a MD and very alternative that has a passion for working with frequencies. She was thrilled with what I told her and also explained that when they go to the hospital quote there really isn't a great deal that the DRS can do really, it is a bit of a waiting game with strokes. I am so glad that we didn't wait. Had have she been taken to hospital she may very well have had to go through the same stress and trauma as the previous times, this time she did it much easier on her. All of this was carried out with remote settings and using the presets in Spooky. Although I have been involved in natural therapies for over 35 years I never expected that I would have the opportunity like that to help my mother in this way. When it comes down to a stroke there is not a lot one can do but get to the hospital quickly well that is what we thought. No need to tell you how cautious and concerned I was through the entire ordeal, however she did respond to every single application I ran so I my intuition told me that she was going to be alright. I am not sure if I would advise others to take this path but the choice was made by my parents and I just followed my intuition. My advice to everyone working with Spooky is to begin working with your intuition more as the hard work has been done with Spooky. Trust yourselves and follow your own inner guidance. Heather Wardale Hi, I'm using Spooky with manual mode. I choose the frequencies myself by checking the ANS with pulse. My story is about my father. He has for 40 years pains in his ankle after he broke it in bike accident. Well, I checked where he has the most painful areas in his leg and decided on the frequency 115 hertz. It is close frequency to 120 that treat tendons and has the ability to improve ATP production. After 2 minutes I'm using just a coil he had 80% less pain, and after 15 minutes, he had no pain at all, for the whole day. Like a miracle, so he put it for 15 minutes every day, and doesn't take painkillers thanks spooky team Moran even. Dipple CM Pem Chinese Medicine Bioresonance Practice Evans Method. I am a new user to Spooky but have already had a memorable incident from my single generator. I had been trying out a sample of essential oils that form the basis of a mouthwash I wanted to order. 
I switched from a cup a few times throughout the week when my lips and throat started to swell. I have a lot of immediate allergies to substances that are not typical allergens. I placed a cup on the nearest surface, my nightstand, and did a series of night-related acupuncture points to abate the issue. I'm a chronically ill American without great health insurance, so I rely heavily on alternative methods. I forgot about the cup and accidentally drank from it a few days later when I was reaching for water in the middle of the night. I started to panic as my reaction was a lot stronger and my normal methods of handling it were not working. My throat was swelling which always frightens me, since it can cut off my airway, my heart was racing, and I was breaking out in a rash. That's when I remembered Spooky. I searched the database and put on the anaphylaxis frequency, along with other allergy-related frequencies. Within minutes, the swelling in my throat hit a plateau and eventually went down completely within an hour or two. I ended up sleeping better than usual that night, which was miraculous not only because I was shaken from my reaction, but also because I'm an insomniac. I don't recommend what I did but am so grateful to have been rescued by Spooky. Lauren. Hello dear Eccoli Per Sterling from Sweden here I hope you echo are fine and everything is great in your life. We are now heading better times and it seems that more and more people are wakening up. I am so glad for your work and efforts as CLEN. I myself are busy with helping out to get people cured from the wasp problems with illness that has escalated the last five years and so. I will tell you little about my work briefly with the Spooky 2 system, and as I have time get back to you dear with that full review I was telling you about Ina other mail. I've got aware about Rife's work in 2007 when I hit the wall the 2 nd time after too much work and stress, I've developed edema in 2001 on back of my lower legs and the hormone system was in balance, and I gained weight to peak at 173.3 kg in 2004. I've slowly not to say very slowly managed to lose some weight but still in healthy levels. I tried to change the diet, but no able to withhold that so it was easy still to eat junk food when stressing too much with work too much work. In 2009 I started to have an escalating blood pressure for example an average egg diet. 128 web link and I got to the hospital and they prescribed some shitty medicine and it happened nil. Zero, zip I've had much going on that time so I did not think about that frequency therapy could help so I continued to eat the crap that the doctors gave me but in September 2011 I built me a frequency generator that could put out one frequency for example 528 hertz and induced it through headphones as audio and to my astonishment I saw the blood pressure drop to a very normal value for a still overweight guy in his early 40 ties I could not bell of what I saw so I continued for 3 weeks to treat myself 25 minutes before sleep, under meditation, then I stopped and then my blood pressure was ok until I hit the wall again in 2015, but that s another story I share in the rewive later. Then I think in 2012 or in the beginning 2013 I came across the spooky too but I did not pay too much attention to it as I thought it was a very expensive system as the other brands that started at like $3000 and more. As I got a stroke in September 2015, I got time to start to work seriously on my body and focus more on my well-being and health it was a true wake-up call. I started to essentially build a more advanced generator similar to the Spooky UDB still believing that the Spooky 2 system was expensive, I did not even look for it or price, then under the work on my generator I stumbled into Spooky 2 com when crossing on the internet, and saw that the prices on the Spooky 2 was for ordinary people and I right away ordered the starter kit. I started to seriously take care of my body with amazing results, and also my nearest friends, then it got to word of mouth and then I have been having about 65 clients and it is founded by mainly donations and I treat for free, and the results is who of this world sometimes, the success it in the spooky two equipment, closely in conjunction with the operator but also the client's projection. I am so grateful for all people involved in the Spooky 2 team and the results it give us. It's as spiritual, it is pure love, it is pure cosmic source. All love and sincerely thanks per Sterling at the Institute of HRS Health and Therapy Sweden. Ocular migraine with aura I had vitreous detachment in my left eye and now have ocular migraine with an aura in that same eye for a few years now. It appears when I'm under stress. 
my left eye will flash a circle with some dark areas for about 20 minutes. Well, I thought I'd try using the spooky four eyes. I used the JW healing settings with a remote and boost cable. I loaded eye disorders careful extra, eye general ailments, eyes general, eyesight to improve careful extra, stiff neck, stress increase tolerance, brain cell energize and brain normalize. And I'm happy to report that it worked. I have not had any problems for some time now. I can report that it happened again over a year later, but I ran the same program and so far so good. I do have a genetic history of eye trouble. My mother had a stroke behind her left eye and has macular degeneration. Her mother, my grandmother had a stroke behind her left eye and was blind in that eye. I had read that ocular migraines can lead to this condition. I'm so grateful to have found the Spooky 2 and the team that put this together. God bless you all. Sincerely, Sandy Sailor. A post on Relief for Tinnitus Relief Chronic Tinnitus Relief, Action at a Distance These results are just amazing. After only running the tinnitus frequency set for a few hours using the remote no titchable your results were flimsy holding the rods for any length of time was too uncomfortable and the plasma tube is way out of his reach so only the remotes were used. Beset with doubts and turning the system off at night to save money, gradual improvements could no longer be ignored. Now leaving the computer to run 24-7, the worst was yet to come. During the night, there was a power cut, the laptop did not reboot cleanly, the generators were off, and the symptoms were severe on awakening in the morning he checked, restarted the system and gained immediate relief. He also noticed that a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar a day seemed to help. If anyone can explain how that works and he no longer does his daily ritual to help reduce the symptoms. Now this is still early days, but he is over the moon with the results. He asked me at the start are you sure this stuff will work, looking in dismay at the technology, computers and grudgingly cutting off a fingernail I replied there's only one way to find out, you have to get on and try it. It's worked for other people. It may work for you, and it does. Kevin Davies My story is pretty much in the making. I was diagnosed with ovarian cancer, stage IIC, in February of 2016. I made the usual rounds of doctors, only choice I had were several sessions of chemo, hopefully shrinking the tumors, surgery, followed by more chemo. The doctor thought I might gain another four years, maybe. The cancer would come back. He was certain of that. I waited the misery of the treatment compared to the gain, not counting the quality of the gain, waiting with every twinge of the return and then maybe undergoing more chemo. I refused treatment and chose quality of life, still fearing the month ahead of course. I came across your spooky by sheer accident, a short video that I had not been looking for, nothing even close. Within less than a week I was hooked up to this little miracle. Bought seven generators the central, both plasma tubes, lasers etc. Love the idea of uninterrupted treatments. During the night I am hooked up to a minimum of two contacts I have not experienced any pain or discomfort have not seen my oncologist since spring and my GP is excited to follow my progress. We have five family members doing their own treatments for diverse problems, all of them happy. I had been losing weight rapidly and am now gaining again. Words cannot express my gratitude. You and the whole team are a gift to humanity and my greatest hope is that you will be able to survive the formidable opposition. God bless, Erica oh yes, the cost. I have heard people complain about it. Within the few weeks of diagnosing and tests, my co-pays yes, I have insurance came to about the price of spooky and would be even higher by now. As a bonus, I have not been taking any more medications. Blood pressure is pretty normal which used to be high even with medications. Thank you, all of you. Erica hi team I decided to test my spooky to one night going to bed. I said it I thought to relaxation mode. Remote after about 5 minutes of willing myself to relax I felt my heart pounding. It was such a strong sensation that I had to get up. Hopeless I thought. This machine just does not work. In total disgust I went to turn it off. Imagine my surprise and delight when I discovered that I had set it to boost my energy. It certainly did that. I think I felt it all the more because I was fighting it trying to get to sleep. 
that convinced me once and for all that Spooky 2 is a mighty machine. Geraldine Daily Ireland I was excited to receive my Spooky 2 inches August 2015, and was studying up on how to use it, reading the instruction manual, watching some YouTube videos. Shortly after this, over the course of a week or so, I was having increasingly painful tendonitis in my elbow. I had had tendonitis in my elbow several years before and had gotten rid of it after months of a twice daily stretching routine and two cortisone shots. I was very disappointed to have it back again. I visited with my doctor who advised me to ice and immobilize my elbow for a few days. That evening I had the bright idea to try using Spooky 2 for tendonitis, using the remote mode. I was absolutely flabbergasted the next morning to be completely free of elbow pain. A year later it has not returned. I have since used Spooky 2 for various musculoskeletal problems, including painful knees on both myself and my partner, and temporal temporomandibular joint TMJ pain. Sometimes the effects are as fast and complete as that first time, sometimes it takes a few more treatments. Spooky 2 has been a boon for my family and some of my friends, and even better, makes me believe the potential for humankind to put our healing into our own hands is limitless. I hope this wonderful healing technology continues to spread all over the world. Ever yours, Catherine Brady. Dear Spooky 2 family, I have installed a Spooky 2 advanced kit and a Windows tablet computer in a hard top case named Spooky 2 inches a box, so that I can carry it with me like an emergency suitcase for mobile diagnosis and treatment. It is ready for action within a few seconds. All you need is a connection for power supply. Please check out the attached photo and video with Spooky Doll helping me doing the setup. Regards Volker. Had I had the slightest glimpse of where I would be today, when I received my Lyme disease diagnosis 18 months ago, I would have experienced complete peace, warmth and excitement, instead of crippling fear. However, as we all know well, the future is decided by a power much higher and larger than us, making predictions virtually impossible. I began having severe physical, mental and emotional symptoms a little over two years ago, leading to a couple months of complete confusion, perfect health reports from hospitals and doctors, and a wavering faith in life here on earth. The excruciating symptoms did eventually subside for the most part, but lingering and random health issues began to plague me. I had joined a dance class and the instructor had just been diagnosed with chronic Lyme after years of struggles and she shared her story with us. I knew after talking with her, that I had the same illness and she referred to me to her only Lyme specialist in the Central Coast, a naturopath doctor. This opened my eyes to a completely foreign manner of living for me. I had always trusted in MDs in the medical world since my mother was an operating room nurse for years before I was born and boy did my whole perception flip-flop. During my ND's care, I started taking a wealth of natural supplements, with a combination of at least 2-4 types of antibiotics, and I experienced bouts of crushing sickness and also fantastic health. However, the ups and downs were not working for me and my lifestyle at all. After about 8 months of antibiotics, I just knew I could not go much longer on that path and knew the antibiotics were now making me sick. Back in March 2016, I took one of my customers and her roommates to dinner in Hollywood, and we all started discussing different illnesses and I opened up about my chronic Lyme struggles. The roommate instantly asked, what if I told you chronic Lyme is curable? I balked and said I had not heard one person anywhere say those words and she asked if I had an open mind, which I have been blessed with my whole life. So that is the moment that flipped my world upside down but in the most beautiful form imaginable. She shared her story of healing many ailments using frequencies to target pathogens, and she was now dear friends with the man who helped her down that road. She instantly dialed his number, told him a few nuggets about my situation, and he agreed to see me right away. A few weeks later, I walked into Jack's I will keep his true name anonymous office and all he knew was I had a Lyme diagnosis. He performed a full body scan on me with two handheld cylinders, and within 15 minutes he saw all the issues I had been facing with my health, which had taken many years of doctor visits, tests and scans to determine. I was completely floored to say the least. 
How could a 15-minute process in which all I was required to do was hold cylinders, produce such accurate and factual results? I was impressed, fascinated and felt a tingling in my gut like never before. I wanted to know more as soon as possible. Jack has a variety of frequency machines, and had an older spooky two generator in remote setup with a person's hair roots and during one visit, he started explaining quantum entanglement and how that machine operated. As non-scientific as I have always claimed to be, it was slightly difficult for me to grasp, but I knew in my gut that this was something darn special and that it was truth. As Jack resides three hours from where I live, I knew I would need to research frequency machines and eventually purchase one for myself. After hours and days of online research, and talking with Jack about different machines, I decided that Spooky 2 was the direction I wanted to pursue. I felt there was such a wealth of support and community on the Spooky 2 website, and I had joined the Spooky 2 Rife for Life at this point and had read through basically every post since its inception. I was also impressed with the cost versus the other Rife units out there. I decided to start with two generators, and it was like Christmas when they arrived. I spent every free moment over the next couple weeks researching all I could and learning everything possible about Spooky 2 and frequency healing. I was completely obsessed and also had a new spark in life that I had not experienced in many years. I lost hours of sleep because all I wanted was to know more and more and more. I knew that frequency healing was in my destiny and that someday I would also be able to heal others and animals, which I knew instantly to be my ultimate calling in life. I have always been someone who just wants to help the world find more peace, love and happiness, and now here is a device that can aid in my quest. After just a couple weeks, I bought two more generators and a fifth a couple weeks after that. I also bought every new device that became available PEMF, laser, ultrasound and at this point, I was well into the Morgellons protocol on three generators, treating myself and about six others that had various forms of illness. I also began direct contact sessions on various people and pets right away. With each contact session, from working on painful muscles in next to planned rewards, to spondylosis in my five-year-old dog to major back pain, we experienced immediate relief and results. I so enjoyed working on my friends and seeing such amazement and joy in their eyes. As soon as the Spooky 2 Central and Plasma became available, I asked Jack what he thought and he immediately ordered one. When I saw him a few weeks after that, he had already ordered two more and could not say enough about the device. That is also when he did another body scan on me this is about July 2016 and after about four sessions from him and a full Morgellons and terrain run on myself and he said he did not detect any Borrelia Lyme in my body. I had stopped taking all antibiotics after my first session with Jack back in March 2016 and had let my naturopath know I was exploring an alternative route, of which he was supportive. Little did I know that those next four months would be virtually pain-free and symptom-free, just from this frequency healing and I truly felt deep down that the Lyme no longer occupied my body. I was absolutely flabbergasted during that July visit and could barely contain my tears of joy. I continued working with many different people and animals and during a large horse show in August 2016, I began talking with two different ladies that ride with my barn, and let them in on my newfound healing journey. Both ladies were barely able to walk with severe back issues. I brought one of my generators and tens pads to the show that same afternoon and began their first session. Both noticed immediate results and asked to be worked on the next day, and the next and with their diminishing pain, we developed quite a close friendship. One of my horse trainers was showing a three-year-old, mega-talented horse at this show who had bowed his tendon just that past week. A bowed tendon is an injury that truly needs many months of healing and barely any exercise. In this horse show industry, that just cannot happen and it is a very sad fact, but it is the truth. I. Being super sensitive to the emotional connection I have with animals, instantly asked if I could work on him to at least try and relieve some of the pain. I researched bowed tendon and discovered that tendonitis in people is similar and that there is also a lot of scar healing and tissue healing that needs to occur. I placed the contact pads on either side of his tendon, near the bow, and created a program specialized for that injury, and worked on him every day at that show. 
they were also icing him daily and kept the leg wrapped at all times. What do you know that my trainer and this amazing stallion went on to win reserve champion out of 86 entries? I have continued treating Riker when I visit the barn, and we have spent the last couple of weeks at a huge competition in Reno where I have been working on him and many others. I used the laser every other day for six days wrapped on his bow and ran accelerate healing programs, and on the other days I hooked him up with tens pads and ran tendinitis programs. He has also been on remote for about a week using hair that is running pain programs, tendinitis and accelerate programs. Out of over 200 horses, he made the top 25 and is off to show in the finals this weekend. He has been sound and pain-free, which is quite impressive with this type of injury. I would like to share my other successes in Reno worked on a skeptical man for his sinusitis that he has had for years. I set him up with the Spooky Central, Ultrasonic and TENS pads and ran some sinusitis programs. He noticed the effects immediately and even had some sensation in his gums that had been numb for many years. I heard from him four days after the treatment and he said he couldn't believe it that his sinuses were perfect. Worked on a woman who has suffered from osteoarthritis for years. She has even had stem cell treatment because she couldn't even wash her hair. I just set her up with tens in the generator and ran 30-45 minute osteoarthritis programs on her for three sessions. She said she was actually in less pain just after the first session and was quite amazed. Worked on a woman with severed neck pain and ran neck pain and stiff neck programs with the TENS pads and generator, and then had her hold the laser on the most painful area on her neck and ran the neck pain program again. I also ran mood elevator and a depression program and she noticed huge improvements in both her neck and mood. The day after, she told me her neck didn't have pain where the laser was placed. Worked on a young man who had a gnarly hangover, headache and was sick with a bad cold and cough. I ran the hangover programs, rapid relief and headache programs, along with the cough program. He had stopped coughing excessively by the end of the session and his headache was greatly improved and he was able to get through his busy day showing horses. Worked on my horse for muscle soreness in her back and hind end. I placed tens pads on one side of her withers and then another pad on the opposite side on top of her rump. I ran muscle relaxing, muscle soreness and muscle cramp programs and did these for three days in a row and she seemed to be pain free and we ended up placing very well and winning money. Worked on my friend, Shelly, who I had started working with at the last show for her back. She has some nasty parasites and was very sick and prone to pneumonia. She went and met with Jack a few times since she lives where he works, and he told me the frequencies and waveform to use on her. I set her up with the Spooky Central, TENS, and Plasma and also ran a separate generator for her back pains. She held the ultrasonic wand on her chest and coughed a lot through the session and noticed she felt more through the contact pads than she ever had. She has been feeling much better and is pneumonia-free. I had purchased my Spooky Central and Plasma right around mid-August and it has been one of the best investments of my life. I have now been using the Plasma on my 13-year-old Rhodesian Ridgeback Scarlet, who was recently diagnosed with a lung tumor the size of an apple. Obviously, I am not interested in chemoradiation, especially because of her age, but I would like to keep her as healthy and pain-free as possible for the rest of her days here. I run various lung tumor and cancer sweeps on her every single night, and even after the first night of setting up the plasma as close to her bed as possible, she has been full of a new zest and alertness like I have not seen in months and her appetite is better than normal. She, and my three other Ridgies, seem to be drawn to the plasma effects and I have extreme faith in this unit that it will only increase the quality of life for not just Scarlet but all my babies as I do spooky two sweeps constantly as well. When I got home from Reno for a week, Scarlet hadn't eaten in five days and was extremely listless and looking like she was in transition to the next life. I started her back up on my plasma and ran appetite and nausea programs, along with pain, detox and her normal cancer programs. Just 24 hours after I started running these, she ate a little hamburger and then even went for a 12-minute walk the next morning. She seems to have completely come back to life and I am absolutely amazed. Right back to life this is something I truly did not think was possible. 
Scarlett has not gagged at all in the past couple weeks since I started her sessions, which leads me to believe the tumor is shrinking. She does not seem to be in any sort of pain, and is just nearing her final days on Earth. I have also started working on some deeper, longer-term issues that I have been diagnosed with such as ovarian cysts, bladder issues and a couple others and will continue to keep the Spooky2 community updated on my results. I know 100% that I have found my calling in life through frequency healing. I have a wonderful full-time job in sales with a company that I joined as a startup over 12 years ago. This career allows me freedom and flexibility as long as I continue growing sales each year, so I do not anticipate making frequency healing a career. However, my heart fills to the brim during all the sessions I have encountered with others pets so I plan on offering this miraculous healing to all those in my life who potentially could use relief and I have quickly discovered that is most every person out there in this world. Someday I might make a move to jump further in and also make a career out of it since it fulfills every part of my being, but for now, I am just beyond grateful for meeting Jack and stumbling upon the Spooky2 website so soon in my journey. Vanessa Lawrence Spooky2 success story dog with high liver enzymes with little hope returns to normal February 2, 2016 Alt GPT 139 normal 0-120 August 5, 2016 Alt GPT 127 Spooky2 settings amplitude 5V, square wave, harmonic F2 equal F1 X3 add F1 to F2 Spooky2 frequency sets ran detox 3 toxins in the kidneys and liver prov liver 1 prov liver 2 prov hip joint pain cell regeneration immune system stimulation 3 prov blood cleanser prov lymphs and detox prov oxygenate cells then afterwards the terrain protocol details of our story our healthy active 8 year old shih tzu small breed dog became very ill earlier this year 2016 after sitting in his crate for 3-4 days, shaking, not responding to voice commands, in obvious great pain, difficulty walking due to high liver enzymes causes leg swelling and progressively getting worse. We took him to the vet for blood work. His liver enzymes were high and of great concern and there was not much the vet said he could do for him. He gave me a brochure about stem cell replacement and sent him home with liver treats. I came home to research his specific liver enzyme and stem cell replacement. The expense of stem cell replacement and going to such a specialist would not be an option not when I had Spooky too. After researching, I felt he would be in critical care within a month as he had been spiraling downhill quickly over the previous month. I was left with gloom doom thoughts of losing our sweet, pretty little love bug that I had raised, loved and cared for since he was 5.5 weeks old. Eight years old is much too young to die. One website noted ALT enzymes were hard to reverse. Another one stated, if an animal's ALT level is elevated, it's cause for concern. ALT is produced inside liver cells and the only way it can reach the bloodstream is through a ruptured cell. So an elevated ALT value without elevation in other markers may indicate rapid death of, or injury to, liver cells. Instead of stem cell therapy, we chose Spooky to Rife Therapy, the herbs milk thistle and turmeric and occasional liver treats. The above program was run by Plasma Mode 3X, by Remote Mode for 4-6 weeks then off on for 2 more months. Milk thistle and turmeric were supplemented for approximately 6 weeks as well as the liver treats the vet gave. After he visibly showed improvement, I ran the terrain protocol. He improved even more. At the August vet checkup, ALT enzyme went down to 127. It reduced by 12 points. The vet chuckled and said, this is good, real good. He seemed surprised. I am confident it has come down even more by his actions. Our Shih Tzu exhibits no pain in his legs or hips. He now is more affectionate jumping in my face to give me kisses, plays with his squeak toys which he has not really touched in a couple of years, runs, jumps, barks at the other dogs and seems so happy. He seems like he was when he was 4-5 years old, yet he is now 9 years old and healthy. In 2016 America is expected to spend nearly $16 billion on vet care. I am very thankful for Spooky2 and the many successes we have already had with all our pets and humans and the many more expected to come. Susie Smith 
Testimonial from Simeon Tadoria For many years I have been making my own electronic gadgets, so that I could use frequencies. However limited electronic skills and no money was a great obstacle. At the same time every manufacturer of Rife devices worked for profit until John White. And until Spooky 2. Spooky 2 opened new worlds for me. Those worlds still expand and many new wonderful solutions come out to help us. Here is one example of the help Spooky 2 brought to me. For some weeks I had pains inside my left ear and the throat on the left middle ear infection at the level of my thyroid eustachian tube. I tried various means, drops, etc. and nothing helped. I found an article reading that middle ear infection is usually caused by streptococcus pneumonias, Haemophilus influenzae, Morax alicatarilis, Staphylococcus aureus, E. coli, Klebsiella, Enterobacter or Pseudomonas aeruginosa. I used the JW Killing Remote Preset and Frequency Sets for all of the above pathogens from the database for a day and a night and all my ear pains disappeared. None of them showed two days after that. However I felt my left ear plugged so I ran remotely the serum and frequency sets from the database using the JW Killing Remote Preset again and unbelievably the next four mornings I had liquefied ear wax coming out of my left ear. This was the easiest cleaning of my ear until then. Months after that I am not having ear troubles at all. Thank you John White, Echo Lee and all the smart members of the Spooky team for your selfishness and hard work. May Lord give you all excellent health and calmness of mind. Simeon. My Spooky Story, by Susan I Fear It's Cancer. Those were the words that my Obden said to me on April 12, 2016. My name is Susan and I was officially diagnosed on July 1, 2016 with stage IB2 adenocarcinoma, a rare form of cervical cancer. The doctor said from the beginning that I would need a hysterectomy. Well, having had five kids, you may think, she doesn't need her uterus anymore, just let them take it out. Easy for you to say. You're not the one that's going to get cut open and gutted like a fish. I was in tears. I did not want to have a hysterectomy. I knew I definitely did not want chemo and radiation. Plus words I had heard kept ringing in my ear, you can't cut the cancer out. When you hear the word cancer, God certainly gets your attention. I began seeking him fervently and my relationship with him has grown. A few days after my initial Obden visit, I came across the Truth About Cancer series. They were airing the series for free and the starting air date was April 12, 2016, the same date that I found out that I might have cancer. Coincidence? Perhaps, if you are not a believer, you might think so, but to me, this was God speaking to me. This series opened the window into a whole world of alternative cancer therapies. I researched many of them and implemented what I could. My motto is God is bigger than my imperfect cancer treatment. He can use this or that to heal me or he can even use nothing. My life is in his hands. I was relying on him to show me which path to take. I remember the good friend of mine had told me years before about a machine that she owned which helped her aunt heal from breast cancer with only two weeks of treatment. Unbelievably, they went in to do surgery and could not find her cancer, so they decided to take out extra margins, just in case they missed it. Upon biopsy, no cancer cells were found. I called my friend and she offered to treat me if I could just fly out to see her. She called her machine the microcurrent machine. This story from a trusted friend helped open my mind to Rife therapy and I began in-depth research. We both agreed that it would be better that I use the airplane money to invest in my own machine. But was this really real? Could it really help me? So many questions abounded and then I came across this verse Proverbs 8:12 I, Wisdom, dwell with prudence, and find out knowledge of witty inventions. Witty inventions? I had to look up the verse for myself. Did the Bible really use the words witty inventions? This rife machine certainly was a witty invention and I was gaining much knowledge about it. This verse was God's assurance to me that I was on the right path. But which device was I to invest in? According to my research, looking for a device with these options were important able to produce a carrier wave, plasma is best, harmonics, contact is good, a device. 
that can do all of Wright's original frequencies and after seeing Anthony Holland's TED talk demonstration, was there even a device out there that produced Holland's 11th harmonic? I thought there was no machine out there that did everything I was looking for that I could actually afford and I almost settled for paying big bucks for something less than what I really wanted. Here comes Spooky. In my research, I kept coming across Spooky too, but kept dismissing it. Surely, such a tiny device wasn't going to get me what I was after. And what a strange name and logo. It looks like a toy. But the night before my payment on another device was due, I decided to search Yawatube for cervical cancer frequencies and came across the Spooky 2 Yawatube video. I played the video with the frequency set just to see what it would be like. What was that? I felt a twinge in my pelvis. I couldn't believe it. My body was actually responding to those frequencies. So I decided that before I jump in and spend a few thousand dollars on a device, let me just research the Spooky 2 thing first. I couldn't believe it. Everything that I had researched was in the system. Everything. The plasma, the contact, the TENS pads like my friend's machine, bonus. A biofeedback scan just like an expensive clinic that I had looked into that uses Rife technology I could do my own scan at home. And what tipped me over the edge, the capability of doing Holland's 11th harmonic. All for less than what I was going to spend on the handheld plasma device that I would have to sit for hours holding. Plus, the spooky people were trying to keep costs down and not make a profit just because they want to help people. That really spoke to me. I decided to get the whole shebang. I was going to pay that much anyway and it would come with the Planetron Plasma device, like one that I had been drooling over that I couldn't afford. I could actually just sit in front of it hands-free just like I'm doing now as I write out my story. And oh, there's also this little extra thing called remote. What? My mind was blown. Quantum entanglement, Einstein, spooky, what? Einstein's quote spooky action at a distance ah, I see why it's called spooky. It's actually based on science. It seemed too good to be true. I thought, even if the remote thing doesn't work, I have all the other things that I was looking for. Surely, God was opening the door for me to get this device. I knew this was the device for me. I put in the order, but later that day, for some reason, I realized that my credit card didn't go through the first time. I fixed the problem, but then doubt started to creep in oh no, I've made a mistake. What if that was a sign? What if I just fell for a scam? I was in despair, but then in my time with God that day. I read Sarah Young's devotional book, Jesus Calling, book 27th entry the birth date of my youngest child, taken from scripture and written as if Jesus is speaking directly to you I the creator of the universe, and the most creative being imaginable. I will not leave you circling in deeply rutted paths. Instead, I will lead you. Along fresh trails of adventure, revealing to you things you did not know. I was in tears. This was the confirmation and assurance from my heavenly father that I needed. He was speaking directly to me. Yes. My God is creative and he is revealing to me things that I do not know with all of this quantum entanglement remote healing. He invented it all. He created it all and we are only learning about how his universe works. The devotional ended with, stay in communication with me. Follow my guiding presence. Yes, this was the path that he had opened up for me. I just needed to walk with him down this path and he gave me incredible assurance and peace. While I waited for my Spooky 2 package, I spent time getting to know the software and reading the testimonials. I soon discovered that almost all of the testimonials and videos were actually talking about their success with remote. It was kind of the main thing. As a busy mom, this has been the greatest blessing. When I went to Walmart for the first time while on remote, I almost cried. I was doing something proactive to help restore my health and living my life at the same time. On August 12th, my full Spooky 2 package arrived and I began my first cancer treatment via remote. Did you catch that? August 12th. I didn't catch it that first day either, but just when I needed some encouragement, God revealed it to me. 
I started my treatment on 8 slash 12. Just like the verse PROV812 about witty inventions. PROV is short for Proverbs and all you Spooky 2 users will know that PROV in Spooky language means proven without God, you may say coincidence. To me, it was my God giving me a little sign that I am on the right path. I had to come to the decision that I either believe that all the promises in the Bible are true or I don't. I decided to trust him and I put my life on the line to do it. My potential surgery dates have come and gone and I have decided I'm not going to schedule one at all. So here I am, walking step by step, moment by moment with my Lord down his path of healing for me. It's an incredible journey and it's certainly an adventure as he promised. I am on my journey toward healing with God and Spooky too at my side have I had some actual, practical success? Yes, I have. And I am amazed every time. Tingling on my tongue and twinging in my pelvis via remote, worms eliminated via plasma, sunburns soothed via contact, hemorrhoids shrinking soothed via plasma, foot cramp better in 10 minutes via remote, return 3 minutes after machine was stopped. Better in 10 minutes when Spooky 2 back on, broken toe healing fast with coil, plasma and remote sessions for fracture, these are all little confirmations that I'm on the right path and Spooky 2 works. If it works for these things and it has worked for others, why wouldn't God use it to help me too? I wish I could tell you that my cancer has been completely healed, but I am still on that journey, my adventure with Spooky 2 and God, my healer is to be continued. Susan mother of five conquering cancer naturally with faith and hope and peace. Hello everyone. So, I was dealing with two kinda of inflammatory process proctitis and gangivitis, my gangivitis was pretty bad, herbs mouthwashes wasn't working. I decided to test MW frequencies for this. I've run ibuprofen MW with JW molecular weight preset 20 amp instead of 4. But also I did some research and discovered the molecular weight from three natural anti-inflammatory compounds. Helenolin, dehydrohelenolin and chamazuline from arnica and chamomile plants. M262.30102, M264.3169, M184.27684 created a custom set with these and run with JW molecular weight preset with 20 app. In the next day my gangivitis was 80% better, now it's 100% 4 days later now, 4 days later I've stopped the natural anti-inflammatory sets and left ibuprofen running, my mouth is still fine. The proctitis is gone, can't feel it anymore. D. Thanks to everyone who did the MW discovery, it works wonderfully, I'm running now the MW. Of serotonin, working very well on my mood by the way. Luz Wilhelm. Hello. My name is Asaf Bentov. I had diagnosed with bipolar disorder and schizophrenia. I had used Spooky 2 for the past 5 months with other staff that I used. And I can say for sure that I passed the sickens, I am no longer using any kind of medicine, and I am feeling very good and happy. Of course it's not the only thing that helped my go through that but it was very effective treatment that I used to be cure. Thank you very much for the help and the support. I fully recommend to use Spooky 2 to treat the sickens. I also used it for relaxation and sleep. Asaf Bentov. I received my Spooky 2 a month ago. It was a little overwhelming when I got my package and put everything together but the videos were on point with exactly how to do it. Then came the software. After downloading it I thought how everything was so Greek to me. I watched more videos and felt more confident every time I have used Spooky 2. Yeah me. I started off by running the 11 day detox on myself, husband, and a couple of dogs and found interesting but strange improvement. I have not been able to tolerate the Texas heat and humidity for 25 plus years and after mowing, trimming and cleaning the yard starting very early in the day I would come in completely overheated and prostrated and would have to rest 2-4 hours. A trip to the Caribbean in April of this year was intolerable because of my issue. I have now done the yard four times without any prostration and have worked in the hot garage on projects whilst dripping wet from sweat without any problem whatsoever. This is phenomenal. My memory has shown signs of improvement also. 
I have more and more people on board and I'm running the 11 day detox constantly. I am running out of spooky to space. A friend of mine reported one day after putting her dog on detox program using only his nails and remote patents tumors are mast cell cancer. Very, very common in boxers. She continued, did you start anything on him today? He is very stinky today. Charlotte Garland. Hello Echo Lee. I want to bring you up to date on my research and enter the contest. Please let me know if this suffices as a contest entry or if I should post it somewhere else. I have been studying rife for at least 10 years, and I was saving for a rife machine. It cost $6,000. Then I found out about Spooky 2 and I was able to purchase a better rife machine from you. I added Spooky Central and Plamza Tube later and still save $4,000. I taught at Quantum Institute for Holistic Health in 2014 and they were so convinced by what I had to say that they also purchased a Spooky 2 setup. Very important. Per David Burke. So you may desire to edit the contest postings accordingly. Since we do not practice medicine or treat people by law, I will show my research in relevant terms. We do not want to do or say anything that would put Spooky 2 or any of the team in jeopardy. Therefore these are research experiment as people participating are referred to as subjects. Subject 1 Miblisekhan Ki had facial surgery and returned home with severe facial bruising. The next day she was in a class. That night she employed Spooky 2 programs for bruises and healing using remote mode. The following day at class all the women were very impressed and shocked because most of the bruising was gone. Facelift surgery usually takes three weeks or more for swelling and bruising to subside. Subject 2 milliseconds K's son was involved in a motorcycle crash. He lost a great deal of skin and was fighting off infections. After return from hospital, his recovery was expedited with Spooky 2. Healing was rapid and no infection was able to take hold. Frequencies used were for healing, bruising, skin collagen. Subject 3 milliseconds STRWJENSKI from Kazakhstan was living at Quantum with two school aged daughters. Her husband was killed in war some time ago, she spoke broken English. After a few months of watching us, Ms. S asked me if she took an experiment. She explained that she had been depressed for a long time and wondered if Spooky 2 had anything relative. Sure enough Spooky 2 does. So she started the experiment choosing remote 32 minutes later she came to my suite and her face was radiant and she was smiling, panting, and out of breath with excitement. SH said my depression is gone. It feel like somebody lifted it off of my shoulders. She could not stop smiling and she thanked me deeply. She lived with us another few months, the depression never returned, and she even started dating. Subject 4 Benjamin, Benjamin and I met in a non-related way. He is a quadriplegic and had bladder cancer surgery. The doctors were concerned about the cancer spreading. I educated Benjamin about Spooky 2. He was so impressed that he purchased a four Spooky 2 generator setup. He has since added laser. He had his people set everything up to run in remote mode. The programs were for terrain cleanup. Within 36 hours Benjamin called me and said he knew Spooky 2 was real because he was having classic detox symptoms. He had the programs adjusted, and added Herxheimer to deal with the toxic die-off. He is very courageous. Benjamin did NOT stop his experiment at any time, and the Herxing stopped in about 4 days. In about 30 days Benjamin was no longer pale, and he was actually growing new hair on his mostly bald head. His eyes were brighter and he was feeling much better. Benjamin had to go into hospital for some procedure that he had done before. His stay for this was typically three weeks. Benjamin was home in one week. His MD said he recovered very quickly and did not need to stay three weeks. Benjamin has finished terrain protocol and continuing with treatment. On one visit I saw Benjamin move both his right leg and arm. He had been paralyzed for years. So progress is being made. His goal is to get out of bed and walk again. I know he will. Subject 5 Mr. J. Mr. J has suffered hay fever for years. During a visit he decided to experiment with Spooky 2. 
he held the plasma tube while running allergy and hay fever frequencies. Before the experiment he was agitated and sneezy and itchy eyes, etc. Within 20 minutes all symptoms were gone and he was getting sleepy. He is now preparing to purchase his own spooky two setup. Subject 6 College Student Party Boy Dronin Dronin saw my spooky two setup and was interested. So I explained it to him. Right away he purchased his own. He experimented on himself after consuming too much alcohol and the hangover was vanquished quickly. Then Dronin decided to run the spooky two hangover frequencies and leave them running when he went out drinking. This time no hangover. This is not something I suggest. I am including this for informational purposes only. Dronin has a relative with cancer and given four months to live. We will keep you posted on her and Spooky 2 as relevant. Dronin used remote exclusively. Subject 7 Annabelle Annabelle was diagnosed with hepatitis C. She felt bad and the doctors refused to treat her until the disease got worse. She decided to experiment with Spooky 2 remote. She was located 2480 miles away from the generator. Within 60 days she sent an email stating I am free of hepatitis C. Subject 8 Malicia 20 year female college student with panic attacks and has to sleep with lights on. She came to an open house and I spoke about Spooky 2 and Rife at the event. She decided to experiment choosing remote mode. She contacted me the next day and said the very SAME night of the experiment she rested peacefully, no panic attacks, and she actually got out of bed to turn the lights off in order to sleep properly. Subject 9 Myself I had blood poisoning from staph and strep and carbon monoxide. I was hospitalized at five locations all within one year because the doctors no longer heal, they treat and release. My doctor told me this when I asked him to keep me in the hospital until healed. So they kept treating and releasing me. I was given over 100 liters of antibiotics, some experimental. Also numerous shots, pills, and ointments. The drugs took their toll. It was determined in addition to the drug damages were skin infections that were fungal and bacterial. Also cellulitis, dermatitis, non-specific contact dermatitis, eczema, psoriasis, pityriasis, and on and on. It was clear, they were guessing. Even my primary physician told me the specialists were experimenting on me because they did not know what was wrong. So I had to go totally naked. When I did go out, I wore a one-piece garment that looks like a wrap skirt to minimize skin loss. I called the FDA's CDC and drug companies. They told me that the side effects are listed and they have no cure for the side effects. Main problem was my skin would simply come off my body. No skin means infections can get in plus being skinned alive daily hurts. You cannot lay down in a bed, sit in a chair, take a bath. I would literally stand up until I passed out from exhaustion. I cried a bit too. I got tired of feeling bad, smelling bad, and having to be naked all the time. Fortunately soon after this I got my own Spooky 2. So I experimented with everything I thought may help inside of Spooky 2. Then I started using Spooky 2 biofeedback for diagnostics, then ran those top 20 hits for a week. Then I scanned again and ran those top 20 frequencies. And I am getting better from what they said could not be healed. I was making success before, however biofeedback made everything faster. Now 95% of my skin is cleared. I can bathe, shower, and wear clothing most of the day. Then recently I started feeling weird and sick. I did a biofeedback session and it was odd. I came up with numbers that seemed pretty close to each other. A common ailment to these numbers was something called Leishmaniasis, a parasitic disease that is found in parts of the tropics caused by a sand fly bite. Conventional MD have no real cure for all the forms of Leishmaniasis. They also say they have a difficult time even diagnosing it. I had the symptoms. How did I get this? Well six weeks ago I was on a tropic beach. Infested with sand flies. Everyone else at the beach simply stayed in the water to avid the flies as much as possible. But we were still getting bit now and then. It did not hurt much. 
So I checked and of course Spooky2 has something for Leishmaniasis too. So I simply ran the scan as a frequency set and WOW am I getting results. This is no placebo effect. I have done parasite cleans as before and I can tell you some things are coming out that never belonged inside of me. It is such a blessing to have Spooky2 and being able to run experiments including diagnostics, then being able to run those diagnostic frequencies as experiments. Had I not done so, a potentially life-threatening parasitic disease could have taken advantage of hosting in my body and causing problems for years. Side Effect Bloating in my stomach area is decreased and I now can wear slacks an inch smaller than before. Side Effect My skin has taken on a much better finish. It is hard to describe this, addendum. I like being part of the team. No one should have to suffer. So I have been working to make things better. I have been experimenting with ways, and getting successful at making riffing even more effective using Spooky 2. I will be releasing details soon. Here are the basics when I invented a new remote method I call Local Remote. It vastly increases the effects of remote transmission without altering the equipment in any way. 2. I invented a new easier and more effective direct contact mode. Again without altering the Spooky 2 equipment in any way. 3. I have been finding some very interesting non-health related, potentially money saving uses of this equipment, and money making uses for this equipment. Since it is non-medical restrictions do not apply. Ha ha ha. For a holistic wellness center here is closing as its owner needs to focus on some other businesses she has. She will be missed. However she likes me a lot and I am going to pick up where she left off. I will be meeting with her soon to get the details on how she ran the business without hassle from any agencies all these years. 5. I have been doing some work in broadcasting as well. I now have my own full video and radio recording facilities. I have invitations to appear on radio and TV. I want to get the most out of the so I will produce an informational series featuring Rife and Spooky too. When they are ready I will let you see them before I release anything to the public. All my generators are tied up in use 24 7 right now. As I am still running Leishmaniasis frequencies, and Herxheimer, and a few other health related issues. Once I have more generators I can expedite what I am doing. Once I have the legality set up like the wellness center did, then I can start making house calls. And putting on training sessions all within the parameters set up in the local and federal guidelines. I have already conferred with another natural healing advocate Dr. Darius Dincia on how he legally disseminates information on his natural healing device, which he has been doing all within legal guidelines for several decades. B. Y. the way, I learned of Dr. Dincia from the Spooky2 forum. So my friend, Echo Lee. Even if I do not treat people on house calls, educating them on the equipment causes them to want to own their own Spooky2. Spooky 2 is very affordable so people are willing Tom take a chance to take back their health and their life. The more Spooky 2 units we get out in the world the more good that comes from it. I have plenty more success stories I can share with you if you like. Thank you for bringing this fine technology to us Echo. God bless. Professor Edgar L. Hawkins